Friday Night Pints, brought to you by fucking nobody today. We're rocking out with whatever you want. We're drinking whatever you want, eating whatever you want. So we got our Miller Lite flowing, of course, New Amsterdam. I'm gonna make up a transfusion for Frankie right now. Shane Gillis is in the building. Hey. I'm not Shane should be sitting up front. Like, we're kind of blocking Shane. Oh, that's all right. Yeah, why not? Why don't you, <laughs> why don't you see him? Yeah, why don't you all right. Up there. We gotta get our guests in shot, you know? All right. Shane Thanks. DM'd me not too long ago, uh, yeah. saying, I think I can get down with this, this show format. Yeah. And I was like, yeah, I think you'll fit in. So uh, Shane's here. That's good. good? <laughs> yeah. Too much? No. I got I got like I got poor shamed oh, last okay. last week. I was apparently making it a little too heavy. Oh, that's perfect. Look at that. So yeah, Shane's joining us. He'll be drinking and hanging out. Um, Feidelberg did the unthinkable today, <laughs> and he worked out. What? In the middle of like the work day, he came back in here. It looked like he had gone to war. So he, he was, was literally, he was sitting on it, he was like this. I thought he was on heroin when I walked up to the bar. <laughs> like, why is he been, nodding off? been working out, right, or no? I took a break. Well, what happened was, so we're in a weight loss challenge, Shane. Um, and the first two weeks, I took it very seriously. I went sober, I wasn't drinking, I was working out, and I gained weight. So then the next week, I went back to not working out and drinking, and I lost five pounds. So I've been sticking with that recipe. Honestly, that is like your body. <laughs> Is, is just reversed from like normal humans, where it's like, this is what we need to function well. <laughs> yeah. And you deprive, it's like, you know, you it's like, <laughs> that's what you need to be healthy. Yeah, My, I taught this car to run fucking, uh, what is it, corn oil? Yeah. Yeah, uh, this does, I don't need diesel. Uh, <laughs> I don't need super unlighted. This. You're going ethanol. <laughs> yeah, yeah, ethanol, there it ethanol, is. Yeah. Are you, you still working out? You, no, no. Happens, no, happens, no. The pandemic really put a dent into my progress, yeah. and I just haven't, <laughs> we, haven't, haven't got around to it in the past we year. We were talking about it yesterday, it's super <laughs> fucked up that when you don't work out, you get skinnier, because we're, for a while there you were like Jack. Well, I lost all my muscles, and then I, I, I have gotten <laughs> all fat. All my muscles. <laughs> I have gotten fat before. Like in college, I'd get home from college, I'd gain 25 pounds every summer. I remember and like when I first started working at <laughs> bar school, I, I got up to like 185, but I've been 155 for like the past year and I, I eat like shit and I don't work out. And so this maybe is, you're not Jewish? <laughs> Surprisingly yeah. not. Yeah. That's pretty funny. <laughs> he, was, he, told, he told me, he was like, uh, this guy, most, you'll meet him, he's the most Jewish non-Jew you'll ever meet. Oh, okay. I was going to say, how did you, <laughs> did you do your research on Until you started speaking. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. Not <laughs> Jewish somehow. <laughs> I lost all my muscles. <laughs> but you, you got, you got like in pretty good shape, but then you got shamed out of it. Remember that? I didn't get shamed. I didn't That's stop you, because yeah, no, you know, I did all, not. All, all the girls were no, like, wait, I did the girls not were stop. in or out. The girls, the girls were in. Was, and Dave was and out. Dave, Dave didn't like that the girls bizarre, liked it, right? Yeah. yeah. They looked bizarre. No, but I didn't stop because of that. I, I was still working out until the gym shut down. I put out a workout video mm, March mm. 5th last year, I believe. I don't deny what? that, but like you were. <laughs> <laughs> a touch of the tism as well. <laughs> <laughs> you, 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 were, you were putting out what now? Workout video. I put out a video of like me working out like early March, and like the Dave doing? stuff was like mid January. Was it, it was like a it was joke? Like, yeah, it was a joke. Okay. Oh, right. Right. Like bossing I got scared. Like, yeah. like I told <laughs> Willie like, that I could hang some muscle on his like skinny little frame. Got it. Yeah. Okay, all right. Uh, but yeah, when you were like looking good, Dave didn't like that, and, and you might have kept working out, but you you took your, your foot off the gas. Yeah, I mean, you know, it wasn't a total stop, but it certainly slowed the momentum a little bit. Yeah. Dude, oh, these whoop things. Yeah. I mean, so I'm in a group with a couple of professional hockey players that when their Sit. stats are no, but like I want to see how how different I was gonna be, right? So. I'm laying in bed the other day and I was a three point here a fucking card. <laughs> I'm a three point eight strain, right? And and my HRV was a twenty seven. You and all your of a sudden strain. they look at me. What's an HRV? Like, it's like your heart variability rate or whatever. Yeah. And they're like, I look at in this group and it says Frankie Brelli, last place. <laughs> and there's they're at sixteen uh, and I'm at three. And they're they're Yours HRV's makes up. No sense. They messaged me and they said, Are you having a heart attack really? right now? Are you, are you dying? Like, you should be dead. The, so well, the, I'm the, just these, the most these things measure all your activity, and the chart goes up to like 22 or something. Yeah. And Frankie never gets above a three. It's like literally <laughs> impossible. I woke up with like a two and a Dude, half. They don't you start do. wake up around you, three point four. Up. They yeah. don't yeah. start the number. Like they, they start the chart at four, and I'm always below the chart. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a blue dot. It's supposed to be bars. <laughs> You I, get, I get like daily. You make me feel good about myself. I get weekly check-ins from people that I'm in this group with that are like, "Are you breathing right now?" <laughs> but now you're, now you're in a roller hockey league, and I bet it goes up on. You are in a roller hockey league. Yeah, it's absurd. Yeah. So yeah. I've never played organized hockey before, and now I'm doing. So, so, it. Do you even like know the rules? So like, I, I, 
diehard hockey I mean, I fan. Yeah. Like, watch every single game. <laughs> so I'm playing in this roller hockey league as if I, like, know what I'm doing. I'm doing stereotypical hockey things in this league, and it's actually been very funny. Do you like, think you're the only person in the roller hockey league who's had sex before? <laughs> Are you? I mean, the, 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 the only other person you're in. The only other person in the world I know who did this was Nate. <laughs> no, Nate joined see, a roller hockey league. I think mm. roller hockey on Long Island is like really big compared to ice. It's like a badass, cool thing to do. Yeah, like we all we all fuck chicks. And <laughs> yeah, it's like the there's like there's, there's groupies waiting outside yeah. the ring when you guys are done. Yeah, I was late to the second period. Are there, are there ring rats? I, so they're, I had they're an like orgy like in yeah. the locker. Yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> Couldn't get their hands off me. So sad. You do you not want to talk about the roller hockey league? More because we're making fun of it. <laughs> I'm trying to think of my team, and I don't think anyone's at sex. <laughs> it's not like one guy. What's your team name? The Outcast. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah. oh, heavens to what? Frank. What, what's the thing? Take us through the etymology of that. Look at it. Look at it. The wheels are spinning. Like, I, how do I spin this? How can I make this sound better than it is? Because when we talk about it on our podcast, because he talks about it a lot, it's like he's like, this is the coolest thing ever. Yeah. <laughs> Let me ask you something. Are you like, are you like the coolest kid on the team? Yeah. Yeah. You're, you're probably the coolest kid on the team. Yeah, they all drive like Ford Rams. <laughs> Alright, well that rules. I was gonna say that's not so bad. No, too. but it's like the it's like it's the, the little dick syndrome, I feel like. Yeah. <laughs> so. Are they watching this right now? How do you like, know, how do you know fuck, that? man? Is it random people no, or they're like they're like friends of, of friends and Oh, he, he's getting real weird. Yeah. Yeah. They're like, they're from Frankie's like, I don't think class. No, I'm like trying to think. I'm just like, yeah, I don't think it's cool. Like, are you, uh, are quit. you like, I you know. Quit. <laughs> oh, I'm just I'm going to quit you, the <laughs> Are you playing well? Like, are you a star on the team right now? I'm quitting right now. <laughs> <laughs> what are you going to say? No, I want to see. No, I mean, it, it is, very, it is a, it's just nice to get active. Yeah, me. well, you need you know, it, apparently, I need man. it, so it's like once a week. I don't I get give my a heart shit about out. anybody, like, not being, like, healthy or whatever they do. You scare me. I'm like, I you, need it. No, you I need, need to get it. active. I mean, I'm getting fat. <laughs> yeah, that one picture. <laughs> <laughs> he, he had, it's not we, one picture, dude. Like, it's well, just, the one picture, though, he had one that went viral over, right. over like, the Christmas just let it break. Go. He looked like the, the moon emoji. It was perfectly yeah, round. Bro, I've had this kid that has that has commented on every fuck. Has it been you? <laughs> <laughs> I wish it was me. It's a great idea for dude, a Dude, this kid, Frankie Moonface is his fucking name. And every fucking tweet and picture YouTube and video, video, YouTube video, no matter who face. it was, Chicks in the Office, so he'd just say, Frankie has a face like the moon. <laughs> <laughs> right? Yeah. Hashtag moon kid. Hashtag moon kid. <laughs> and then uh, he fucking, he made me get a moon face. Like, I ended up eating and like fucking okay. my face got fat and yeah, he beat me. It is really no, just better it. to let it go, right? And yeah, like, what are you, fuck? emotionally eating? <laughs> I think I'm having a bar yeah. stool. Yeah. <laughs> I came up here expecting no, you know what? You know what, I think we all, I think it did get like enough, like there was enough viewers and enough people that it was like, oh shit. We're, we're all ugly, <laughs> and yeah. we get reminded of it incessantly. Yeah. But it is better to just be no, like, yeah, I'm ugly. I get it. I get it. Yeah. Yeah. A lot of the comments <laughs> just said I have downs. <laughs> that's it. That's, really like that's, that. like, <laughs> that's just the majority of it. That's just every comment. Yeah. That's all right. Those guys rule. <laughs> I'm down. <with> <laughs> Well, you were just I saying you, you, were, uh, you had an audience, uh, you were doing stand-up of like a bunch of hot chicks. Oh, I was like, this is, this is not for me. This is not what I want. It was terrible. I was up there and it's like literally an audience of like well-dressed hot chicks. It's like, it's like no nothing I You guys aren't going to relate to this yeah. stuff. It's the, I, I opened talking about like the night, the night Stalker killing a... <laughs> Killing an old people yeah. with a hammer. And I was like, isn't that funny? <laughs> like, wow. like, what is this guy saying? <laughs> yeah. Exactly who is the audience for that, Shane? <laughs> a lot of people. Yeah. It's usually like three or four people. I'll put my hand up on that one. Yeah. <laughs> no, it's very funny. It sounds funny. funny. Yeah. It is funny. It is. Uh, it's just a funny thought, though. Here's one I was stage. thinking today, and I don't know if this bit's going to work. Uh, you see that gymnast? Coach that killed himself. Oh, yes. himself? Yeah. Dude. Yeah. He was like Larry Nassau, yeah. like boy, right? What a baller. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. Just like him. Jesus no, all right, hold on. Just him, <laughs> no, him knowing he was gonna kill himself and someone's like he's getting like hate mail and all this shit of like you're gonna rot in prison and just him being like, I bet you I don't. <laughs> just, uh -huh. just like, well I guarantee you I don't. <laughs> that was really shot on that one. Yeah, yeah. Because as soon as the verdict came in, he was like, I'm not going to jail. <laughs> That's I mean I would absolutely kill myself before I went to jail yeah. for life, you know? No. Who was the um That almost be freeing. I would not kill myself. Yeah. Well I'm not going to jail, so yeah. <laughs> 
you <laughs> fret the whole time you, yeah. during your trial, like, oh no, what's gonna happen? Guilty. All right. Yeah, objection. I'm <laughs> Overruled. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going. <laughs> Wasn't well, there that woman? This woman like killed her husband. I think this is probably like early Barstool days. We're blogging about her, and she killed her husband. I think, or she killed someone, and then as she was found guilty and was getting pulled out, pulled into jail. She was like, just give me the fucking death penalty. <laughs> and it, but she only got like 10 years. <laughs> she was like, well, she yeah, was, when you were 37, lady. Yeah, calm down. Yeah. She was like demanding the death penalty. Yeah. Like, like, just go to jail for the next month. You're fine. <laughs> You'll be on probation. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that guy you're talking about, he didn't even wait for the trial. He was like, I'm just out now. <laughs> yeah. they, they filed charges and he was like, I'm out. <laughs> I, I, he didn't want to go through the trial. Yeah, no, yeah. He didn't want to sit there like you guys say. Like he didn't want to sit in that trial and be like, I wonder what the verdict's gonna be. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That, you would kill yourself before jail, Frankie? That's surprising me. This is wait, all, I mean, also depends on what you go to jail me, for. This, my was jail. His, this was my favorite. His life was. This was one of my favorite stories ever. This was August 27th, <laughs> 2009. I started at Barstool like August 15th, 2009. It was one of the first blogs like I ever wrote for the website. And uh, it was man found not guilty in sex crime trial, but committed suicide. Wow. <laughs> and so shortly after the jury gave his verdict in the case of blah, 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 it was clear something went wrong. Um, I guess I guess he wasn't like, I guess he was at home. He wasn't like in the, in, you know, held on anything. Um, but she called and left a voicemail. They found you not guilty. Please don't do anything. Oh. <laughs> and, oh. and, but also, it's like that guy was well, clearly, guilty. That guy was, was guilty, of guilty and they and they yeah. just like couldn't yeah. prove it. It's like, uh, but I remember that it was the first blog. I, I mean, I put the whole description, the whole story, and I just wrote whoops. And that was like the first blog I ever wrote was one word. Oh, like, yeah, that was it. <laughs> my favorite one ever was like an early one too, and I I forget. It's like happened in Russia or something like that, and some dude was found in the woods. Like handcuffed to a tree, and like <laughs> he'd been part of like some kind of sex play, and he was Are getting hilarious. eaten by a bear. Like that, they found him, but they found a dildo in his, oh, his throat. Mouth. Yep, yep. And I was like, I was like, come on, man. like if you're gonna be with your boy, like you gotta at least get the dildo out. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah. the one thing you have to get. Like if you want to run, run. Fine, I get it. There's a bear coming. But at least, but get that dildo out of my throat. <laughs> it's not like my That's wife and kids oh. acting like me. <laughs> I, uh, I did. Uh, this, these are like the old school blogs where we really could let it fly. And like I was saying, things have things have changed. But when I went on Legion of Skanks a couple weeks ago, no, I know, dude. I was, <laughs> no, I know. And I, and I remember, Shane got in. Was it really like this summer that you really like this past year you started Last getting year, in? Yeah. yeah. Because I was like, you know, you've really been making noise with the skanks, and you were like, yeah, man, but they are just garbage people. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. No, those are like, they're like my best friends. But yeah. The the, the crowd is. I mean, it's, it's just crazy. It, like I said, we used to let it fly, but I don't know if we ever really let it fly like they did. And it was the no. only time. I'm usually the big mouth, like getting in trouble here. And I pushed the microphone away, and I was uh, like, "Yeah, yeah, yeah." I, I, I enjoyed that. watching you. I didn't like, even laugh at like, some things. Ooh, <laughs> yeah. ooh, ooh. Well, yeah. I, I went in being like, I, I, I'm excited to do this because I haven't really just like been, you know, on airways where I can just rip. And the first three topics, it was like rape. And bombs and and like incest or something. And I was just like, no, no, the guy God the, the guy saying the N word is Puerto Rican, just so yeah, well. Yeah. So Which is, is legal okay. in New York. <laughs> <laughs> somehow. Somehow that, in New York, Puerto yeah, they Ricans. Get a free pass. <laughs> just say it. And everyone's like, all right, all right. But yeah. Yeah, yeah it they, is. They, they but something about Lewis saying it. I don't know, he's not quite Puerto Rican enough. Yeah, he doesn't, he doesn't look good. He's or, half black. And even then, him saying the N word, it's still like, <laughs> Am I gonna get fired? He can start it. He can start the word. He just here? can't finish it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like halfway there. I, I uh, like. I was afraid to even. Yeah, that was that. I was afraid to even laugh at some of the shit. I was like, I just see the fucking headlines now. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Barstool employee yucking it up about these things. You're just so afraid of getting canceled. No, I'm not. Or, I mean, I'm really not. Fun. You've been like, I feel like he's so the opposite. Of you just uh, don't want to go through it again. Yeah. You, you said you want to. You want to get canceled. I will one day get canceled. Yeah. Right. And yeah. it will be the sweet release. <laughs> like, like the guy, like. Yeah, the fucking, okay, yeah. Well, the, I bet you I'm not going to jail. I'm just going to be like, he thank you. Himself, you know? yeah. Yeah. He goes, I'll almost run out to yeah. me. Yeah. 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 He'll get the last laugh. Oh, yeah. Be hanging from the fucking bathroom. I mean, at this point, I'm laughing off the like the Tiger Woods thing. I was like. That, that was, I guess, bigger than I realized, but I, I was saying on KFC Radio, Kirk Minahan texted me, being like, are you okay? My ex-wife texted me, are you okay? I got a call what from my this? best friend. I, I, 
Uh, so when Tiger first got, like when that, the news broke about Tiger's accident, yeah. there was like one tweet that was out that said, Tiger Woods had a car accident and has broken both his legs, which we've been doing this for like 10 years. That's a internet hoax, like a classic. It's happened to Peyton Manning, Cam Newton, Russell Wilson, mm. Jay Cutler, and it's always that exact headline. So-and-so in a car accident broke both their legs. So I heard that and I was like, this isn't real. This happens like every three years, it's a new hoax. And I was like, this shit is fake, idiots. And then, <laughs> like, the next second, there was a picture of, like, a mangled car. Ah. And everybody also, I mean, the guy broke his leg. And everyone basically was, like, pl planning his funeral. You know yeah. what I mean? Well, it's easy so, to say afterwards once we knew he broke his leg. Huh? The initial report was he broke his leg. Yeah. No, yeah. but then there was, like, we don't, like, they airlifted him to a hospital. No, Jaws of Life. Like, Jaws of Life. Jaws of Life, Jaws of life is misleading. It makes you think he's it's clinging to the Jaws crowbar. of Life. It's, a it's cool. just a fancy <laughs> robot. The door opener. The yeah. door got bent, yeah. so we had to use a machine to open the so door. So all that went on, and I was like, this is a hoax. And then I was like, fuck, no, it's not. But I, I mean, I guess it was, it just happens to me so often now yeah. that I really, I was, I was, like, happy when I realized I was, Truly, truly unfazed. Like it wasn't one of those like I don't even care, man. And you're yeah. really on the inside, like oh fuck, oh fuck. I was like going about my business. We had we did the clubhouse thing that night. I was just like whatever, man. But everyone kept being like, are you okay? And I kept being like, yes. What's wrong? I thought I was like, are you okay? What's happening? Yeah, you're right. mad because you said it was an hoax. Yes. Yeah. Oh, well, that's not. What kind not... of replies were you getting? Um, well, a lot of people were thinking. <laughs> this is how fucking stupid people are. People were thinking that I was saying that Tiger came up with the hoax, that he was the uh, one. They were like, what, does Tiger want to fake his death to get a new identity? I wouldn't put it's like, past It's not Tiger him. doing no. it, you dumb motherfuckers. <laughs> I wouldn't put it past him. He, he might need to. I mean, he is. <laughs> None of this is funny, Frank. He's the biggest Tiger guy in the world. No, I came around. These two almost, look at their <laughs> they're about to jump over the bar. I came around almost on puked on the floor. Like, yeah. they were. I did feel like I was going to puke when the news broke. Because you guys were trying to convince me to tweet out the hoax shit. No. I <laughs> they were. You, you were see, pacing around the office. I was pacing. Yeah. What's I wrote, funny is uh, I kept computer. telling people on the internet, I was like, these tweets are not jokes. I just thought it was a right. fake story. If you saw the footage of me, I was joking around. <laughs> oh, yeah. I was dancing on, like, the fake grave. Being yeah. Like, no, you, it is no big deal. You guys are like, just tweet it. Like, if you're right, Dude, the yeah. second wrong, tweet, cares? The second tweet was crazy, though. Which one? The, 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 the police department said that this happened, and you're like, Hoke City Population Police well, Department. That, yeah. I was like, there's <laughs> no way it's fake at this point. <laughs> well, that's, yeah, that was a joke. That was me being like, clearly, it's not a fucking yeah, hoax anymore. Okay, I right. was like, hoax, I said, Hoax City popu uh, Population 1, Tiger Woods. And then the <laughs> and then the Sheriff's Department came out, so I said, Hoax City Population 2, Sheriff's Department. Department. But that was me being like, okay. obviously, fucking, yeah. it's real. Um, I was like, I was living. <laughs> Trent's not. Trent hasn't said a goddamn word. No, I, he's fine now, so it's fine. I was, I was trying to. I, I really started. I was fine. trying to calm you down. Like, and you were so nervous, and I, and I just genuinely believed it wasn't it was real. So I was like, yeah. Trent, don't even. Well, it's like the Kobe it. stuff happens. It all of a sudden, so Tiger so drives like off a fucking cliff. You're like, I know, well, but you guys, it felt like Kobe. I mean, it felt, yeah. felt like Kobe, but he broke his leg. I didn't think it. So I mean. When you saw a picture of that the car is, mangled They just the said floor. his legs were fucked up. It's That's like, all right, I mean. who if cares? There, if there was reports that was like, we don't know what's like happening Tiger, it was like he broke, he has like leg injuries. Yeah. If he had died, it would have come out quick that he had died, I feel like. It well, would have been yeah, like, I mean, a I guess, drawn out what happened. Isn't it happen? crazy though, the way the world works where it's like, now it's all jokes about Tiger and stuff, but like, if he just dies, it's the fuck, like, uh, we're mm -hmm. Tiger memorials for the rest of time, but because he survived and he'll maybe never walk again. It's like, well, fuck Tiger. He's had a crazy pass and all of a sudden. Until he dies, he's going to get fucking murdered. That's why dying's the best, man. That's why I can't wait for death either. Cancel me and kill me, because then people will actually like me. We should, do a, uh, we should do a group suicide on this show right now. Yeah, just I'm pass down. around and fucking... Yeah, yeah. yeah I'd like to pass. Yeah, you know how many more followers I'd get when I'm fucking dead, man? You know, people nah, you'd have one good day and you'd be like, fuck it. I'm going to yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. I'll do it. What made you come around? <laughs> I'll fucking do it, dude. What made you come around on Tiger, Shane? Uh, well, I was being pretty gay about it at first, <laughs> when I was a young man. I was a young man, right when the thing broke, he was like... I remember my dad being like, fuck this guy. And I was like, yeah. Like when, when, like his, when he was uh, having sex. Yeah, yeah, right. And I was right, like, right. what a piece of shit. <laughs> and then I like, I listened to like Norm Macdonald say one joke about it, and I was like, damn, I'm a bitch. And I can't believe I was a pussy about this. And then I, when you watch that documentary on HBO, when he's having like press conferences, for that getting, was nuts. forgetting pussy. That and was, he walks into a room of people that are like, like everyone's sad. Literally. And he had to go out and be like, I got so much pussy. <laughs> 
<laughs> and everyone's like, oh. And it's, it's, it's not just a random crowd, it's literally just <laughs> crazy. <laughs> it's like his mom, it's his, his little, 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 friend's well, family being like, I almost just threw up. Listen to that? I made a noise I've never Dude, before. watch that I just <laughs> press conference. When, when he, <laughs> so he, he, he goes up and he walks over to his mom. Oh, my God, dude. That should have been a celebration. And the flash bowl was like. Yeah. Crazy. And and then the fucking statement that the Masters put out. I mean, yeah. Well, that's crazy. That's I mean, bad. they were like, he'll have to like win, win like our respect. Dude, back that after guy this runs like, like, like pretentious fuck golf. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Like, it's one of the most pretentious, like obviously historically crazy racist, racist yeah. golf clubs in America. Or whatever. They have their own history, and all of a sudden he's like talking about someone's sexual life and personal life. Like you, he's not on your team. Like he doesn't right. represent you at all. Yeah. Right. Tiger Woods is a golfer that actually has brought your sport. To so many more billions of dollars, Absolutely. you should be on your hands and knees. You should be next in line. Yes, yeah, right. <laughs> like, it's crazy. Yeah, that, that that doc was so wild when they tell the stories about him being in Vegas. Because I, I said <laughs> the other day on my podcast, being like, "There's never been anybody in the world who was more equipped to ha to become a legendary sports figure. Like he was so fucking good, but less equipped to handle being that guy. You know, but that 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 story where he was like talking to Michael Jordan, he was like. What, what do I say to these girls? And MJ was like, what do you fucking mean? Like, I, I don't know what to say to them. He's like, just say that you're Tiger Woods. Right. Like, what, yeah. what you, how bad are you at this, dude? I yeah. mean, he, he, he was not meant, to, he, he's meant to like, be an accountant and drive a Ford Focus. You know, yeah. Well, he, I don't know about drive. Maybe <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Uber. Honestly, though, no, yeah. Like, it's why time to start why Uber. does Tiger keep driving so places? It's places. time to start. See, that's where I, I don't care what people say that. Yeah. Like, he's a fucking human being. You gotta drive places. You're not gonna you always have a job. You're gonna have a job. Everyone says that. That's the point. You always drive. You hire someone full time to sit in your fucking. We always say that. I'm rich. I'm gonna have someone drive me around and fucking pick up my food for me. I don't like driving. Like people drive. No, no. I'm not saying everybody who's People rich. Drive. I'm saying the guy who keeps crashing or getting caught drunk driving should never drive once anymore. or twice. <laughs> <laughs> We've all done it. Dude, how many do you think he walked away from? Oh, like DUIs where yeah. they're like, holy shit, Tiger Woods, dude, keep it moving. That's why I can't believe the one in Jupiter. <laughs> like, I think he was just so Dude, he was up. zonked in Like, that. they were like, yeah. we can't. That was like, hilarious. sorry, Tiger. They said, where are you? Yeah, they're in Florida. And they said, where are you right now? He said, Southern California. Jupiter. That's the wrong part of the map. He thought he was on actual Jupiter. Jupiter, he was asleep at a red light, right? Yeah, that. I mean, he was just like, like full off to the side. Like, the Imagine being that fucked up. Trying to really just going, <laughs> <laughs> he has no idea where he was. Yeah, so dude. drunk. That was the Tony LaRusso did that one too. Tony LaRusso has like what 90 UIs. Yeah. Yeah. He just, he he just, I feel like he gets pulled over drunk and he's like, "What's up, fellas? See you again." Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. The uh, the blower in his car. Yeah. So, so he, to like start the. Yeah. So he'd get in and he would. Have, that's some said, trash people shit. He got a new he got a new job and he had to drive his boss somewhere. And his boss Pops goes, in. hold on one second. <laughs> 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 off when you got to deep throw your steering wheel before you can start your car. He had like five DUIs. We're like, Chris, how are you not in jail, man? Dude, like, the know. guy in Oregon this week set a record? 0.77. Yeah. Wow. Whoa. Seems impossible. Dead, That's probably. like the highest ever. Highest ever. Be, he, he uh, the record of a woman also from Oregon. Really? Yeah. Oregon. She was like 0.73, right? Yeah. Something See, that's like dangerous because that. that's where you get, like, if I was still in college, I'd be like, let's go. I'm gonna fuck. Oh, I think we passed the point of danger. You had college, we had a breath. Yeah, we did that. We had to get rid of it. I have three breath. There was a lot of alcohol. I'm like, three breath. In college, we had one. So we, point we, like, we're all just playing games right. trying to get a high score. And we're like, yeah, right. We just throw this away. Like, yeah. Yeah. Three, yeah. More for three more points and all of his blood Ooh. is alcohol. No, no, no. Well, no, 1% of, of his blood. Of his blood. Yeah. Yeah. Point oh, right, right, right. That's zero right. point I'm almost thinking of it like fucking a batting you ball. You are. <laughs> point. Just, I'm so off. so stupid. I'm so off. <laughs> so that was so off. So you're saying that the cover, the ocean's covered in that 0. 0.7 does not mean 70% of your blood. That's a, I, I, I was thinking, that's what it meant until he said that. No, I was, thinking of, I was thinking of batting average almost, like 0. 0.300 is like you're like 300. That's right. exactly But what would a batting average of 0. 0.03 be? I know. You know what I mean? That's no, like I was just off. So, we were but you up realize that. that was bad. <laughs> we were mic'd up for everything yeah. on the show. You thought that too? <laughs> Yeah, until so like you, seven seconds. I thought like, I thought like, I didn't do the math. I'm too lazy to do the math. Like, so yeah, that's you're idiots about it. You're talking about that would be just alcohol running through your veins. <laughs> yeah, when you go on a the, calculator, 0.70 is 70%. This is 0.77. You said she blew 0.7? Yeah, 0.77. 
Zero so point seven percent of her. Right. Point seven point seven is seventy seven percent. All right, right. now right. I'm starting to come around yeah. on this. <laughs> <laughs> you might be right. No, no dude, I'm correct. That's seventy seven percent of one. Why? Yeah, because so it's zero point seven seven. Drop the gloves. You're now kissing. Yes. 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 Let's go. <laughs> On the left wing. I don't know why. 0.77 of 1%? I know it's not 70 So we're supposed to know when we're talking about blood alcohol <laughs> content levels. I think we throw out all percentages that we've ever known forever. We but on a calculator, all... you times that by 100.77. Yeah. Yes. 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 I do that all along. I was like, you guys cashing out. That, you also think that you're not going to assume that then 77% of your blood is alcohol. That's yeah, right. that's the percent. number one thing. I mean, thing. we're setting records yeah. here. I'm like, percent. we're setting records here. I thought maybe. Your body I don't even alcohol. know how that would work. But that's like, yeah. All. yeah. yeah what either. happened to my blood? Yeah. Where'd my blood go? Yeah. Where'd the blood go if it's all just alcohol? This is barstool, dude. Oh, this is the barstool. That is so not that the 77. That's 77 percent. You're still fucking here. Right. Yeah. You, you don't times it by 100? Just, no, I have. You're I just times it by 100. Seconds. No, I have 100, right? right? I have 100 things. I times it <laughs> by <laughs> point times 77. It. Yeah. Times it. And now you got 77. Right. So I'm not times it. You have 100 bloods. You just times it by 100. Oh, I did. I times it. I times it. I times it. Oh, times it by God! <laughs> Just times it. Yeah, that, this is one of our dumber times conversations it. ever. Yeah. yeah. Talk to yeah, me about the lot. universe if you really want to get dumb. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I, just I tried universe. to tell him about the fucking. Um, I just don't buy into realities. it. realities. You, you ever dip yeah, into yeah, that yeah. shit? Because like he I said, like the, uh, he said deja vu, uh, and I was like, well, maybe that was your other time. What's it called? The the, the multiverse. Yeah. Yeah. yeah you yeah, fuck yeah. around I'm, with I'm that? Out on all that. You fuck around with that? Come on, man. <laughs> what do you think about this? Whole, what, what do you think about this whole thing we're fucking? Barstool? No. <laughs> this you guys whole want my thing, this <laughs> life, as you know. Um, like a never-ending, expanding universe. What the we fuck? do this all the time. We sit like three do three doors down from each other, three chairs down, and we'll just have these conversations where it ruins our day. Yeah. Where like we walk away being like, "Well, I'm just gonna kill myself." Like, what's yeah. what, what everything we do means nothing. I just watched a new Adam Curtis doc, dude. What's I'm that? all in on this type of talk. What what what, what is? I don't know. Some British guy that makes you sad. Yeah. <laughs> Classic don't they British. All? Yeah. Well, what's his, I've heard what's that his name for Adam Curtis. He's like he's. He what's out cool documentary? What's right. his theory? What's cool his theory? internet people. What is he saying? That's I don't know. Saying. That's the other thing. You can't. It's hard to understand. You'll never figure it out. <laughs> just sit there and watch it. And you're like, all right, I got it. Just uh, as long as you can regurgitate like one or two like. Yeah, it's all the algorithm. It. That's all yeah, you need yeah, to know. Yeah. The algorithm is bad, and it's making us bad. There's. That's it. There's no doubt in my mind that you got. I've seen that. You, you don't believe in it, or you just don't understand it, so you check I just out. don't believe in it. I'm not, I, the Big Bang Theory doesn't even, I don't even believe in it. I think I don't they're actually coming either. around on that. That's yeah. not correct. <laughs> I, I mean, it just seems <laughs> unlikely. I'm a creationist. <laughs> that, like, one. <laughs> yeah. Jesus created us 2,000 years ago. All kidding aside, I think <laughs> the concept of God is more believable than the Big Bang. <laughs> like, a speck of dust exploding into everything that's ever happened? Mm. No way. Yeah. <laughs> no but way. Then, but then we also get into, like, what was the spec? What was it? How did that get was exploding it was into uh, that all? Yeah. And just Act, it just brain. seems unlikely. What percent of you guys' blood is alcohol right now? <laughs> <laughs> what are we doing? I watched that Cosmos with that Neil deGrasse Tyson. I hate that guy. And he's so Fuck smug about it. Yeah. You want to be like, he's an no, asshole, you don't yeah. know what you're talking about. But then he makes fucking points where you're like, well. Oh, I mean, he definitely knows what he's talking about, bro. He's super smart. But, like, but he's, he's so fucking, like, he's so fucking... This fucking guy doesn't know a goddamn thing. <laughs> I'd like to come through the TV and fuck him up. I'm sitting in my room putting on my elbow pads ready for rollerblading. Like, this fuck dude. <laughs> Anything. He's like a rocket. He the grass station would rock rocket. Yeah. Uh, he's no. huge. Yeah, yeah, I think that's right. It's just like, it's the I level of confidence where he's off. like, this is, they zoom out at one point in Cosmos and they show a, a river of bubbles and universes within the river. I'm like, well now, how can you that's sit here and say that that's what's can happening? I, uh, can I actually transfer over to a transfer? I feel like he's it. done, he's probably done more work than you have, though. <laughs> at some point it's a guess. They can't see further than whatever star it is. It's a guess. It's a, it's, it's, it's an educated guess. guess. Yeah. From Any, what, here's what you need to know. Any scientist or astronomer or whatever is trying to be famous is pretty fucking lame. Thank you. You know? Fauci, fuck off. <laughs> well, not be, wearing be, a mask. Because they're trying to be... <laughs> You're We're not allowed to storm the Capitol anymore? Come on. <laughs> Guys aren't allowed to have fun? <laughs> <alcohol. laughs> Shane's got a big fucking... Yeah, dude, we're not allowed to have fun. Oh, speaking of hats, real quick. Barstool's now in the Lids stores. So any official, like, Lids uh, shop you know, you can get the oh, flat, right flat brims, the roll pads, the anything, the official lids, official new era, oh, yeah, but in the lid stores. So yes, yeah, whatever. 
You actually don't look as bad. I used to look. Think I mean, you look. Like you look like. Um, you look younger. I think you look. Yeah, cool. you look like a high school kid on Law and Order who's. <laughs> yeah, who's like your friend is in charge yeah. for sleeping. Yeah, I'm just unconscious. a cool ass dude. Stop doing that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's yeah. The, the, well, you open it up like. Yeah. What's up? You're right. <laughs> hey, 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 cool. 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 Like Tommy Tommy Stoss, by the way, had had a question. Question. Big time upgrade with Tommy Stone. Rowan, Rowan, executive produced this week. Really took it to another level. Tommy walking around the streets now. As a man about town vibe. Did you get almost hit by? A car when you were crossing the street. Yeah, well, now the honk was in the distance, okay, but it, uh, like it, it did. It gave a nice effect. Yeah, it seemed like I was like, this badass didn't even fucking yeah, flinch. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, it was, I would have definitely flinched. If it was. <laughs> I had a nice moment. <laughs> Tunnel was drilled by a car. Yeah. I was with uh, an Arab. Oh <laughs> and a white guy caught, a shame. white guy jaywalked, and me and the Arab were both like, "Fuck this guy!" Oh, it was a nice work. moment. It was a nice moment. It was, it was racial, racial harmony. Yeah, yeah. It was a piece of shit. No, I'm a nice. Why? What, what, anyway. was he, what was the jaywalk? What was the problem? He jaywalked right in front of uh, Madison Square Garden. It was right out there. He literally just crossed the middle of the street, not like. So he did like the diagonal. Yeah, not That's even fun. close to a crosswalk. Just. But did it like fuck with the traffic? Yeah, we had to stop. Oh, that doesn't mind. It was nice. My rule is like, I, I just keep it moving. Like, you keep driving. I know you got the green light. And like, just trust that I will, I'm not going to get hit. You know yeah, what I mean? This I got it all timed didn't out. Even, I got didn't it. hesitate at all. He wasn't trying to pace it. Yeah, he just walked that. straight across. Okay, that's, yeah. that and he was white. Hit. Yeah, that, that, you should be able to. <laughs> well, that's privilege. <laughs> yeah. That is privilege. <laughs> Made it more egregious over, for some reason. <laughs> 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 you know what I mean? You see a white guy jaywalking, you're like, what are you doing? All right. <laughs> 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 Have you, uh, so you, you're acting president of, of Skanks right now? Yes. You, you were, but, so originally Ari won president, you were his vice president, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, So if you don't know, Legion of Skanks, the uh, podcast and like kind of like crew of comics, they do a, is it the second election of this or the first? I don't know. It was yeah, the first. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, who they, cares? They, they, do, they do an election. Who cares at all? If all the fans vote on different, you know, tickets of like two comics. Who was it? Dan Soder was it's with. Soder was with me and Ari, and it was right. basically. The Soder, the Sh Soder G Gillis, Shafir, Super Pack <laughs> yeah, 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 was yeah. unstoppable. Yeah, it was unstoppable. And that, that was the whole point was because Big J and Lewis wanted to win. Yeah. They all, Lewis especially really would like to have won. And we didn't care. So it was funnier, <laughs> it was funnier for us to inject ourselves into their show. They're not, we're not even on the show. <laughs> Just be like, well, we're we're president, and he he actually gets upset. Well, when funny. I was there, that episode I did, they were doing their intern search, yeah. and there was one dude <laughs> who just didn't show up. So imagine like doing Barstool Idol, and like two episodes in a row, the guy just didn't show up. And, and one, one time his excuse, yes. Yeah, so yeah. so one time his excuse was, uh, I went on a Tuesday, and they, he said Tuesday's my busy day. <laughs> <laughs> so we were all like, this is a fucking power move. Yeah, I think yeah. Dave. We were like, we need more Dave. We got to see what Dave has in store next. Like, will he come next week? What is he doing on Tuesdays? <laughs> all of these questions that were like, like who cares about the intern uh, um, like responsibilities? This guy's electric. Yeah. And Lewis, who's like the real head of Skanks, yeah, and the head yeah, yeah. of Gas Digital Network. Was like, no, we fucking, goddamn, yeah. I need someone who's gonna do the fucking intern work, guys. And we're like, but well, what about Dave on a busy Tuesday? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And he was getting so mad. Yeah, so he I gets can very imagine mad. not winning president of his own show. Yeah. It would, it would, it would grind his gears. He did get mad. And that kid that wasn't showing up was a fan of my podcast. Oh, uh, yes. So they were like, what's your favorite podcast on a lie detector? And he like looked at the camera and was like, Matt and Shane Seeker podcast, what up? <laughs> <laughs> that was his whole interview. He was like, honestly, I don't want this job. He was like, this guy's so good. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so well, we, we had called you about him, right? We were like, mm -hmm. it was like two people wanted him to go on to the next round, two people didn't. Oh, yeah. Let's call the president as the the, 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 the the final vote. And he was like, yeah, he likes my podcast. He's like, yeah, okay, yeah, 100%. Have you done, so you're allowed to veto one bit per... There's all these powers that the president has. Do you, are you doing it? I don't really. No, I don't care. <laughs> I'm quite no. It's a podcast president shit. Like, what the, I'm big of a loser, but I, I mean. But no, well, it's only worse than rollerblading. Rollerblading yeah. seems real cool. Right? <laughs> True, I'll give you that. <laughs> Me and my friends, we call ourselves the Legion of Skanks. <laughs> yeah, seriously, I got all this shit for playing a fucking well, sport. The Legion of Skanks name is is. I don't have anything to do with it. It, it, Big J Ogerson started it, and 
at the time, he was just rampantly cheating on his wife. And, and yeah, it is a very funny him story. And, him and like Lewis were like gonna probably go out to like you know bang chicks, and she was like, "Fine, go out with your legion of skanks." Yeah. And they were like, "That sounds like an awesome band name." Like, yeah, they were playing. And, uh, and they, they, they were playing Guitar Hero. What? They were playing Guitar Hero yes. in the living room. Yeah. <laughs> She's like, "Go with your legion of skanks," and they're like, "That's actually the name of our band now." <laughs> so it's the most loser, nice. the most loser thing you could do. Just like strumming a mini guitar <laughs> while somebody who loves you is like, you're ruining my life. Like, Fuck you, bitch. <laughs> I don't even care. <laughs> trying, to, trying to master John the Fish. <laughs> 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 Frankie will do tight. Frankie will pass out. <laughs> Did you call somebody called? Cold as fuck. Uh -huh. I think it maybe it was Nick. Nick was like Frankie and Shane is gonna be something. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. I like it, dude. Yeah. <laughs> it is funny with how tiny it is too. Oh, it's, it's just a video game guitar. <laughs> yeah, you can hear and it. Man, how good did you think you were a guitar though? I know. For a while, I was like, I'm actually pretty good. <laughs> like, at what point am I picking up a real guitar and I'm gonna rip this? <laughs> you ruined my life. It's like, fuck it. Yeah. It's like, don't fear the Reaper's going. I went to a, a, a guy in Florida. I went to a bar with him. He was like my roommate, fresh, uh, my neighbor freshman year. He went to a bar for a a tournament, like they hooked it up, and he oh, God, he fucking awesome. played at a bar in a guitar hero <laughs> tournament, and he won it. Ooh. And we acted like you know he won the fucking gold medal. And like I was like, yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, probably. yeah, I don't think you won anything except like you won tonight's fucking thing. Like, you ever see that South Park about? It? No. At the end, they they do that. They play like as hard as they can forever, and then they finally get it. Part of my language here. It's South Park. It's not me. It's on Comedy Central, a very woke network. And uh, this is how the episode ends. They beat Guitar Hero and at the very end it's like, congratulations, you are fags. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like what your friend did. Uh, so, so Skanks is, is not your show. Matt and, Matt and Shane's, Shane's Secret, Secret Podcast, Podcast yeah, yeah, is, yeah. is the one. Yeah. Uh, and you, you and Matt just chop it up, right? I mean, there's no... Yeah, there's yeah. zero. Yeah. I, I love it that way. <laughs> yeah. It's like, he's into the what are your podcasts about? I'm like... Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Whatever is happening. <laughs> Everyone's yeah. got a hook or a thing. Yeah. I'm just like, ah, fucking nothing. <laughs> Mostly now, these are really about us being depressed. It. Yeah. 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 Mostly yeah. it's about us being depressed. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's the theme right now these days. But yeah, it's one of those like, I don't know why it's a success. Uh, yeah. Go ahead, watch it or don't. What do I care? <laughs> I know, it's so impossible to, like, I, I would go do shows. And then people would be like, oh, you have a podcast? Like, we, what is it? And it'd be like a girl or something asking. And I'd be like, don't. Don't do it. Like, please don't, <laughs> don't listen do it. to it. Yeah. And then now, now it's way worse because people are like, oh, what's your name? You're a comedian? Oh, yeah. I'll just Google you. It's taken out of context. <laughs> yeah, like, oh, how about that? New York Times, racist. <laughs> Dude, I had, oh, this is crazy. This week, a when kid. The Times is calling you that. Yeah, that's that's <laughs> tough, yeah. This kid, uh, he goes to South Carolina. He was doing a class. They, I'm in a textbook. Really? Oh, wow. textbook. Ah, I'm literally cool. textbook racist. <laughs> <laughs> Found that out this week. It's actually, oh, textbook great. racist. Like, like, like the old joke. Like, look up the definition. You'll see his face right you next to it. You actually will. Like, yes. You Google racist comedian. I, <laughs> <laughs> it comes and up, that's dude. crazy because like there's a lot of those. I know. You, and so you being the poster child for it is. I know. And I wasn't even that racist. No, you, I, I mean there's. <laughs> There's definitely worse out there. There's way worse. There's, yeah. You know? That, uh... So, like... <laughs> I, I, was, I was talking to this guy just the other day. He was talking about, uh... uh what does he call it? Fuck. It was like a reputation cleaner or something like that. Yeah. Are you going to do that? No. Uh, somebody told me to do it. I'll call that. And I was like, that sounds like a whole thing. That sounds pretty pussy. <laughs> well, yeah. That, a reputation also, cleaner? It's, some, is that, I, that, it's, like it's a, where you get wiped from the internet. It's, yeah, it's, like, it's, like, it's expensive. Yeah. Yeah. But, but yeah. for the internet, not for like... Oh, I got lucky. Not for real right, life. Right, right, right. Like, he, you know, he, he just cleans up like your Google I got search. Lucky. And I was like... Not only is it pussy, but I was like, it's just, it's going to require, first of all, probably a lot of money. 
Yeah. You have to like call you twice and email and you also ten for times. One. Well, like, what, I mean, what I, opportunities I could, are you going to have after that yeah, you didn't have true. before? That's true. I could maybe deal with, you know, not the first 12 searches. I got lucky. Being. There's a guy named Shane Gillis that uh, assaulted someone with yes. a twisted tea. Right. <laughs> that guy was... Uh, Shane Gillis. No, no way. No way. It's the new Shane Gillis. Wait, the guy who in the... In from like, like the, the meme, from like the video. No, not the black guy that hit the white guy. Oh, that would Unfortunately. be... Unfortunately. Yeah, did that bump you down on the search? Yeah, now if you type in Shane Gillis, the top two... But wait a minute, nice. the real story is so Baby people steps. are beating people up with Twisted Tees, huh? <laughs> yeah. Another? That was another video? <laughs> Yeah, you need. Weapon. You know what you need to do is is like pay, <laughs> oh, pay a great. Shane Gillis to kill this, The woman told deputies Gillis texted her on New Year's Day saying he would kick her door down because he was mad. <laughs> that would be. That's way worse than anything you did. Yeah, for real. That's Legend. Way more than anything, you know? I'd love to give a good old door like a kick down, like a door in. I would. I wouldn't be able. I'd be <laughs> like, <laughs> just like, yeah, yeah, you can you change your name. Sure. This is great. <laughs> Dance. You need like a, a, a stage name now. No. Yeah. What's, what's your, your middle name? Change your name. Michael. So you can be like S. Michael Gillis. You know? Now that he's a real H. Foley. Michael yeah. H. Foley. Yeah. Michael, oh. Michael, Michael, Michael. Mm. That's a popular middle name. Huh. It is. What's your middle name? Joseph. Joseph, yeah. Same. One of those stupid fucking names. Same? You know? Same? That's fucking it's weird. It's a saint's so name, right? Yeah. Three Josephs. We only have. Four middle names amongst the seven of us. Tommy's right? is Moe's. That's the tip. I'm Michael. It's <laughs> <laughs> always doing some sort of math. Well, I mean, that wasn't really too hard of math. To figure out, assuming you What's the real name? like tism thing you have? Is it is it Yankee yeah. games? It's date, just general dates, dates like, in my like, life. Like, yeah. Oh, those are hard for him. He's got to touch the door in the late time. He 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 oh, dates. I thought you meant no. going on dates. Oh, <laughs> well, that's a problem. Remembering, those, like, remembering you know, dates. You, I can throw like a date out, and you'll tell me like what the score of the Yankee game. Oh, we got one. We had one of those. High school. Yeah. You didn't know what all one. Of those. Was. <laughs> yeah. I also can't tie my shoes. Be like, I don't know how yeah. related that tie is. Shoes. Now we're getting down to oh, it. Yeah. Tie your shoes. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, you I can, but they never, they just never stay tied. And for the first five, <laughs> six pairs of Velcro. shoes, I was like, oh, it's just this pair of shoes. <laughs> and then eventually you figure out the common denominator is me. And I, I realized I just don't well, tie them. Uh, what do you, you do? Loop I think I do, do the normal ears? tie. I do the, the, the okay, you pull the two up. Yeah, I could do a live shoe tie. I probably canceled right now. Actually, just did this. All right, so live shoe tie. It's going to be tough, I think. I got my fucking buttons on my ass, on my jeans. Pretty right. nimble. Oh, it is pretty nimble. It's actually hurting. What is yeah. happening? What is happening right now? Tommy's Tom's proving that he can tie his shoes. I mean, see, this is. Yeah. I mean, he just tied his shoes. Yeah, but you know what he does? But they're do? not going to stay tight. You know what he does do is he Pull like tighter. He crosses Harry like angle. very high. Like I cross low. Yeah, you you like cross it? high. You loop oh. high. Those then shoes are even like from the Holocaust. My shoes are a work in progress. I saw a pile of those at the museum. <laughs> These are my great grandfather's. They've been passed, passed down. Is that bad? What's crazy is that's an upgrade. He used to, oh, really? you know, yeah. his shoe game used to be whatever was free. <laughs> yeah, whatever Tom, showed up. He was trying for two years. He just wore free clothes. Yeah. yeah, yeah we, we, what's wrong with free clothes? 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 Right, like every time we do look it up, he gets it right. But I, I imagine sometimes he's. Oh, there's it up. sometimes I'm, I'm off. No, I'm, I never make it up. I'll say if I Dude, don't. Dude, to say November, when I say when the Yankees win the World Series 2009, I said November 4th. That's something that's wrong. That's not great. Winning no, the World Series. That's a big deal. November 4th. Of 2009, I don't know. If you you remember the day? The Mets win? Yes, I remember oh, that. No, I don't think so. I think it was. I think I know, it was as someone who's won a lot of championships, I don't remember any day. I mean, I've only won. Yeah, actually, I don't know. Really <laughs> I was trying to defend Tommy. I have no idea. I, I, I'm just saying I will, I will remember it. Oh, I, I think that will be the one. like only happy day of my miserable life. But I don't think your act would be like, all right, like October. No, because I'm not autistic. But, right, exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> point, point for me. <laughs> <laughs> well, are you on this? Are you ever diagnosed? I mean, no, I don't. I think I'm, my social is okay, right, guys? Right, guys? <laughs> <laughs> it's just a joke. Right? No, I, I don't know. I think I just have a good memory. He used to lick every single fucking page when he read the book. <laughs> <laughs> no, I've never been diagnosed. 
Yeah. Wait, is uh, that true? Slippery slope. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Was I that a it. joke? What? The fact that you even have to like, clarify says a lot about you. <laughs> I don't think you got it, dude. I think you're faking. I think you're stealing that. I'm trying to get. <laughs> I just want all the good parts of autism. The memory. Stolen valor. Yeah, stolen valor. Yeah, I mean, when you first started, we, we called you alarmingly stupid. I didn't think what you, you know. Yeah. <laughs> was, I don't have a lot of common. I don't have time. a lot of common sense. I don't know yeah. if that. That's a well, that one, that's an that insult. one thing was crazy. It was like, like we just needed you to look up like a, a name, I, and you no, were searching I, Seinfeld. That he remembers exactly <laughs> what, what, what was that. You were trying to look up. You were trying to talk about what happens when a boxer gets hit in the head. And oh they, yeah, Adrian Broner had that hematoma. Hematoma. We you guys couldn't think of the word. And he was searching and Seinfeld. For some reason, I had, I was thinking goiter. Goiter from Seinfeld, but I got that confused with gout. So my Google search was Seinfeld gout. <laughs> well, it was, it could not be further off than hematoma. So that moment, we were like, oh, this kid might be like. Dave you know, said you are alarmingly stupid. Yeah, no. yeah. It was alarmingly stupid. Alarmingly stupid, stupid Tommy, you stuck for quite a bit. Yeah, no, it sucks right. that like uh, autism, like with you, the one you have with dates, you've just obsolete now because of the. Yeah, that's not even a good. It's not even a good. It's not even good autism anymore. Right? Yeah, I mean, that used know. to be incredible. <laughs> What's yeah, the yeah, best it's a good. It's a good bar trick. Great girls love. 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 Girls Girls love. Girls but he has like such an obscure date. It's like when did Derek Jeter get his three thousand? Oh, that's July eleventh. <laughs> uh, yeah. No, sorry, July ninth. July ninth, two thousand. Yeah, yeah, big yeah, Yankee. Yankee. He's only else. asked me two Yankee things. Can you uh, do no, it? I do more personal. Main, I mean, what do you want to know? What's Frankie's birthday? Uh, it's, I mean, I don't really. It's like August. Stolen uh, Valor. Stolen Valor. Stolen Valor. He's on me. 13. Oh. That's pretty fucking cool. I mean, that's no, different. 13 of them. I've oh, never had an, an, a, like, an experience. Right what, was, what was the date wow. that Shane Gillis became the most racist comedian ever? <laughs> <laughs> Wasn't big enough in my world. It's actually, uh -oh. it was actually I have to like experience. Who was it? You're that's number three? What's, what's the first three. two? Number one, Oh, racist so comedians? Here, yeah. oh. oh, what the fuck? <laughs> well, you can fix that right here. I know. Just Hold, on. This camera. <laughs> Hold on. What Wait. the fuck is Ari doing, by the way? He's in the Amazon? <laughs> do you, do you, does he have like a. I mean, he's posting to Instagram, so he must be connected. Now, see, what I was doing was typing in racist comedian and clicking image. <laughs> <laughs> you want a picture of yourself? Up there? Yeah, I like that. Look you know what I think? That's it. You know oh, what I think, Gillis? Look at how What's up I your shirt? Like this. That's my friend, Matt. <laughs> I think, you know what? <laughs> Without this, you don't have anything. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like you like being the, the third racist no, comedian. I don't want to be it, but I'm, I'm not going to get replaced. <laughs> <laughs> you know? If you do something, do it well. Say, say something now. Trouble. Maybe you'll yeah, get those God, That shoe one will get me in trouble. Yeah. That shoe one might get me in trouble. No. Shua may not see the light of day. <laughs> Why? That was I know Nick is back there going, oh, fuck. Mm. Uh, the, uh, when we, uh, Troops was on KFC Radio, and it was right after he, he was getting canceled. And uh, Za is getting canceled for the first time, which is very funny. Za, we the have our African midget. And yeah. he is like the most likable. I've never met anyone who doesn't like him, but now there's a whole sect of the internet that thinks he's like a misogynistic oh, asshole. And thinks he's a witch. Yeah. <laughs> yeah he's a, how, well, how would you describe him? He's an African midget. <laughs> well, you know how to just, describe just, him? He's from Africa, and he, and he tells us we can say that. So. You just got it. You <laughs> <laughs> Bruno, back up on the top of the Zai shaped like a kettlebell. Yeah, yeah it's a kettlebell. So. He's the Don't thickest. Don't get around Rogan. Rogan will toss him. Zai weighs as much as, as me, I think. Zai is four almost. foot five, a buck sixty-five. Yeah. Yeah, he weighs as much as me. She is thickest in the office. He, I, I want him to fight and rough around. He's so bad. He's a fuck a You ever see that midget crossover, that other midget? Yes. Dude. The guy, he like goes flying. <laughs> it's right? the best thing I've yeah. ever seen. It's an old video, animals. but watch it. It's the best video yeah. of all time. It sucks for Zach because he he goes by the Midget Zimba. It's his yeah. name, but then people in his community say he's not allowed to. Yeah, I mean, I, I yeah. What's, go the, by what's the hold up? Whatever he said. I've always thought dwarf sounds, like more, sounds <laughs> more offensive than and midget. So, and so does little people. <laughs> little people is the worst of all. Vertically <laughs> challenged. All that shit sounds so Midget is awesome. the best. It's it's all that is so yeah, condescending. Where it's like, yeah, okay, oh, little knows. person. Yeah. Yeah. Like, fuck you, I'm a midget. But I don't know, I guess we're not allowed to say that, so we just said it 35 times. But Would you rather be a midget or a giant? Giant. 
It's funny. I was like, uh, what are giants die, die very soon. Giants yeah. don't uh, exist. We had a like, conversation are, about Zaz's life are, expectancy on breakfast once. Is he? Did, he's gonna. Jeez. Is that dark? That is so I dark. Is he gonna die early? You're better off as so. a midget no, than a giant. No, he's big enough. I think. No, he, that's what he said. He goes, "I'm big enough." <laughs> yeah, giants, they're dead pretty early. Like, yeah, yeah that's that's because their hearts are. I think is good about it. You know, I'm not here for a long time. I'm here for a good time. Yeah. Imagine just walking around being like starting to be tall. He's in for a short fridge. He's talking about. If I no, if I was a giant, I mean, you you you're eight feet tall. You live for like 28 years and you just <laughs> kill it as a giant for you know a couple decades. Get WWE you're out. contract. Yeah. yeah. I, I wouldn't want to be a giant. I'd rather no. be a midge. I'd rather be a midge for yeah. sure. A midge. Same. No way. Yes. Because you gotta so. think. Midget? You live longer and like. But there's so, so many we, things. We it's more both. common. Zaz obviously a little person. Connor. And then, and then Connor. Tall. Tall guy. Tall yeah, one. Tall one. He was like six oh, ten. Yeah, yeah he was, he was legitimately six ten. And just that. watching him, like you know, the ones, the, the six ten people we see are professional athletes. They're the only ones who figured it out. Yeah. Yeah. And if you're six ten in regular life, can't figure yeah, out. What a yeah. loser. They're still what learning. What a fucking loser. He would just trip all over the place <laughs> all the time. <laughs> fucking loser. What a piece of shit loser, <laughs> idiot. Yeah, because if you're, that's the thing. If you're tall, you're mm. expected to. Yeah. Be an everybody's well, like, he I'm border and he went to the Barclays during. During the uh, draft night, and wore a suit and like oh, walked yeah, around yeah. like the draft, and people were like taking pictures with him and yeah. shit. Like, you must have gotten drafted, and it's like, no, I'm just a freak. Yeah. But yeah. I feel like if, but that, I'm not considering that. <laughs> six ten's not giant territory. Six no. ten is giant. No, six ten no. is massive. No, well, no, giant I'm not, is I'm like, like no. a gigantism. Seven, seven, tall yeah. seven. Gigantism is like yeah. seven foot eight. Right, right. Yeah, oh, okay. that would be. But like six ten in regular life is, you know. I would rather be my height than six ten. Yes. I used to ride yeah, the train with this dude Would every day. Would you rather day. be five foot or seven foot eight? Five foot, dude. Five, five foot. foot. Yeah. Five five foot. Yeah. Absolutely. Absolutely. If you, you're not a girl, seven hard. Girls will foot just eight? spit on you when you're not tall. You'll find them like eight. If you're seven, eight, eight they do uh, You got to catch them. <laughs> I, it's, no, that's like girls. It doesn't matter how short girls are. They hate short guys. Yeah. You can oh, find tiny who, who girls. Is how tall is Kevin Hart? How tall is like, that he's dude? He's like 5'4". He's a million fucking million millionaire. How tall is that? I would just, if I was 5'0", oh. I would just become... How tall is that baby boy? Yeah, that's what's holding me back. I don't have that job. I don't have that job right now because I'm a normal height. Oh, my father. Remember the bagel boss guy? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. That guy was 5 foot. Yeah, that's what happened. He's right. He's He's five He's snapped. He's 5 foot. He snapped. He's and yeah, you, you eventually go fucking crazy. Five you're, not my, you're not my, you're not my, what are you saying? You, you, uh, you're not the boss of me, you're not God or my, or my father. <laughs> that disgusting right. Long Island accent. Hey, yeah. Or no, my what father. Are you talking about? <laughs> bagel bosses. Bagel boss rules. So, <laughs> he said us basically, so what are we doing? Today. What are we doing here? Dude, bagel uh, boss. We love bagel boss. Bagel, bagel boss went viral. Company. I called him. I got his number. <laughs> you Talked to him on the phone. <laughs> Wait, I said, he like big time, didn't he? No, we, we oh, were gonna have him on the show. Yeah, we, yeah. Him on the sh we were gonna have him on the show the next day, and then he got canceled. The then next he gets super racist. Uh, yeah, super yeah, racist. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And Ted he, Bowles. He's, he's, he's almost racist? as racist as you. I'm not that racist. <laughs> <laughs> what did he say? Uh, he just had some. Like, he had a bunch cool. of just like crazy oh, stuff we, on oh, Facebook. Oh, he um, it wasn't like he he just did this. That was his shit. He went around to like Dunkin' Donuts and other places, and he would just. He would like goad them into fighting, like making fun of him, and then he'd be like, "Fuck you! You're yeah, like, he, you're a, a heightist or whatever." He, I know he some just, I think small guys, like, and they have they have a real problem with it. They time. hate it. Yeah. yeah. No, absolutely. Especially nowadays, because I mean, the dating apps and everything, like where people are like, "If you're I think fucking that's what short, he was saying. fuck off." Yeah. In the video, yeah. he's like, "I can't I'm even get a date boss. on Tinder because yeah. I'm five four. <laughs> yeah. They, they, <laughs> when, when you have entire apps. <laughs> that just weed you out, you know, like right. like your profile just will not even the, come. The across. algorithm it, is programmed to just push you. The aside. algorithm, <laughs> and it's the number one <laughs> thing. Adam yeah. Curtis. Yeah. It's like the number one. How do I define height? this person? It's instantly height. how tall they are. That's it. It's unbelievable. Yeah. You remember? You remember like some of the smokes that we were like dealing with? They they were like six four is my type. Like yeah. six four. That's enough. crazy. It's like high. six four. <laughs> Jesus. But so they were like hot enough where it's like yeah you probably He's gotta, gotta get be that. a D one fucking at least point guard yeah. maybe power forward. Yeah, I'm, I'm fucking. I'll see you later. Yeah, so if you're like five foot, it's like, yeah, just spit on my face, girls. You just hate me. Dude, here's another uh, would you rather. Someone asked me the other day, would you rather die in 300 degree water, uh, water 70 degree water, or like negative 30 degree? Negative, 70 water. degree water. Negative 30. It takes, you're just drowning. Yes. Okay? But like, Three. Definitely better than boiling. Yeah, I'm definitely burnt out to boil. Yeah, no, no, no. Boil. So cold, 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 I, cold boils the fastest. It's, it's like a shock, but then you just like. I think it shuts you down immediately. Yeah, I do cold. For yeah. sure. You do cold. But Absolutely. seventy. So seventy is what I just try to die. Basically. Yeah, no, I don't want that. That I sounds like the longest. 
I don't. I, yeah, I guess so. Yeah. The, le- I the feel like seventy the might be out of the first. Then. First. But could yeah, you just yeah. go under and just? No way. Boiling's out first. Dude, like that's what I mean. I think seventy yeah, degrees is, is comfortable, out. and you're you just lobster. go underwater yeah. and you die. No, like, no maybe no, the no. least drowning. I feel like seventy, slowly? you're like treading water. That's the most like, horrific. That's as long as you can. Dude, the cold alive. one. The cold one's bad. Like hypothermia is probably I think cold the worst. Is the best. No. I think it's boils best. up. Boils the quickest and probably the least painful. I say you'd rather be up. boiling alive. <laughs> I don't even know what's <laughs> happening. A lobster. Yeah, just throw it in the Cold is the best. I wonder how long could you survive in seventy? Like, how long could you try water before you die? Steve, Steve Chase like, said, you, you know, I don't even, I think he said he could do like, he said 10 he could do 15, I think he did, and he did like three. Oh, yeah, it's and he really tapped out. I mean, I'm going to die. You, know, you can tread water. water. I can't tread water for shit. But you're so treading fast. water, what's the point? You're like, right. oh, once, wait, once, if, once if, I go, I mean, if I knew I was going to die, if it's salt water, it's a little easier. So you're in the ocean. Lay on your back and float. You guys want to hear about the USS Indianapolis? Yes. I was hoping that They lived for a few days out there, treading. Really? Treading? That's when the sharks the came. Sharks came. When was this? Them. This was World War II. Oh. Wait, wait, wait. They dropped off the atomic bomb, and on the way back got sunk, and it was a secret mission, so no one knew about it. And then they fucking, I think 900 guys were in the water, and like 400 or 500 got eaten by fucking sharks. What? Whoa. Three days. Yeah. Have none of you guys seen Jaws? That was the speech, yeah. Yeah, this is the Quinn speech. Uh, yeah. But it's then I, I listened to a book about it. That, uh, the Those captain sharks killed were himself. Eating good, man. <laughs> he shot himself in the head. <laughs> what an idiot. <laughs> With that note, you know what? I think we're going to wrap it up. <laughs> what better way to wrap it up? Uh, so go check out Matt and Shane's Secret Podcast. Yes. Um, anything else? Plug oh, check uh, out uh, Gillian Keebs. It's a sketch show me and my friends are going to start making. It's good. Right. We've got two out right now. The rest of them are coming probably in like April. Okay. So Shane Gillis be good. On, on social? Yeah, Shane M. Gillis. Follow yeah. Shane Gillis. Shane M. Gillis. And, yeah. uh, Michael. Michael. <laughs> Damn. Can I stay and drink? Yeah. Can we stay and drink? Yeah. All right, good. That's the plan. All right. Have a good weekend. We'll see you guys next week on Friday Night Pints. Go get your Lids hats. Go get your Barstool hats at Lids. Shout out to New Era. Yeah, go to the mall. Thanks for watching Friday Night Pints. Make sure you click on the bell icon below to keep up with notifications and make sure you subscribe to our channel. Strong drinks, full pints. Can't lose. Can't lose.